Good morning, it is Saturday the 3rd of September and we are here in Edinburgh for Holyrood Park Run. I'm Douglas, he's Callum and this is Scottish Park Runs. So yeah, Holyrood Park Run, it's the only one I haven't done left on the list of Scottish mm. runs to do now. I've been waiting a while to come here, I think this is event 7 or 8 now, something like that. Cool. I missed the first few and then there was the Fringe basically during the whole of August, so I thought I'll let the Fringe get out of the way, Edinburgh will be really busy at that point, so start of September now, it's a bit quieter. And we've still got quite a nice day from it. I'm looking forward to this one, Callum. How about, how about yourself? Yeah, um, obviously the first thing you hear about when you hear about Holyrood is the famous hills. Uh, yep. So, um, of course, yes, I'm looking forward to it. Can't wait to get stuck <laughs> into those hills. Yeah, like the start of the route, you're you're basically running uphill for about a mile. Then you get a bit flat across the top of Arthur's seat for about another mile. And then you are rewarded by a nice mile downhill Good. after that. So fast finish surely in store for everyone. Yeah, so we've got a nice wee uh, pond behind us with some ducks in it and there's a wee bit of a ruined castle up there as well. Quite a lot to see around this area there of is. Edinburgh. I've, I've never actually been up, but Arthur's seat is actually adjacent that side, is it? I'm not 100% sure, actually. Um, Someone let us know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, apparently the views from the top are really good and it seems like a reasonable day today. It's, um, it was a bit rainy over in Glasgow, but when we got over here, it cleared up a bit, forecast looking good. So hopefully we are rewarded with some nice views at the top. Um, but I reckon we should head over to the start, which is just down that way, and yeah, check out the first timers brief. <laughs> <laughs> you ready? The command will be three, two, one, go. Three, two, one, go! That's us on to the long uphill section now. Get a couple of hundred metres at the start on the flat. But now we're going to run uphill for a good kilometre, mile or so. So, probably won't talk too much until I get up to the top now. Just going through 1k now. Still climbing, legs hurting. <sighs> That's us one mile in now, and it has flattened off, which is good. Towards the end of the flat, there is another wee slight uphill. I'm feeling it now. Looking forward to the downhill. Thank you. Here we are. Good downhill section. Let gravity do its thing. <sighs> I 
has 4k done now that was a 336 kilometer so you can see the benefit you get starting to level off a bit now for the final k Finish line in sight now. Just a few hundred meters to go. Well, that is Holyrood Park Run completed. I think we're all a bit out of breath Aye, after that. That's for sure. How did you find that one, Callum? Yeah, I mean, you had explained the sort of the route uh -huh. when before we'd set off, and while I mean everyone's going to go on about the hills, but I mean. <laughs> It's really tough, but uh -huh. the downhill is That's lovely. It's like coming down a cliff. Yes, yeah. it's uh, the contrast between the up and the down is. Uh, yeah, <laughs> and it was pretty much a mile before it flattened off. I, That's right. I, I checked my watch, and it was yeah. pretty much spot on the mile. Then you've got mainly the flat around the top. Lovely views out across Edinburgh. You can so it was see a Edinburgh wee castle. Yeah. Like, yeah. Uh -huh. There was a wee slight bump before going back downhill right. again, but then you've got a lovely downhill section. Yeah. I think my fourth kilometre was like 336 or something like that. I so I was like, that. you're definitely getting the benefit from downhill. And it flattens off at the end. And I kind of wee, another wee cheeky bump at the end yeah. before you then get towards the finish funnel. But no, I really enjoyed that. That was a nice event. And even with the hill that everyone was on about, I think you can still run it relatively quickly. Yeah, I mean, for, for those coming, I've not had time to do a world famous five step uh -huh. of course, but I mean, it's a busy one. <laughs> yes. You know, you, you forget if you're, probably since COVID, I guess, the mm -hmm. numbers haven't been high in a lot of events. And since COVID, that's probably the busiest event yes. I would say I've been to, you know. Um, so probably be mindful of that, I would say. Absolutely. For the, the football fans, this was one, uh, I noticed the, just the tips of Easter uh -huh. Road. I did have a look for the, no, I did have a no? look for the lesser known stadium, uh, uh, but I couldn't <laughs> see that bit. Um, yeah, that was probably. But no, that was that was awesome. Really enjoyed that, and that is me caught back up again for the moment. So, Bravo, uh, whatever the next event happens to be, I'll definitely see you at that one. There's there's rumours of a few, but um, I think Erskine, Aberfeldy, Castle Douglas, even Yale up on. Uh, up on Shetland again, that'd be quite the trip. Le so I genuinely yeah. left Shetland thinking I had a great weekend, <laughs> it was fantastic. Won't be back, but you know, but but yeah, bring I it on. I would love to go back to be fair. Let, let's bring really, it on. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Well, awesome, good seeing everyone, and we will see you in the next video. Thanks, guys.